into an encounter between traditional enemies. Documentary cameraman Dick Rowcastle, working in the Kruger National Park, captured a dramatic confrontation between a crocodile, a hippopotamus, and an unwitting antelope. Captured in parlor antelope struggles to free itself from the jaws of a crocodile. Enter an enraged hippopotamus, natural enemy of the crocodile. Exit one villain. Scene two, nature extends its feud between hippo and croc to include care and concern for the victim. The hippopotamus is loath to leave the wounded antelope. It nudges the animal from the dangerous waters. The crocodile keeps its distance, but there's little poetic license allowed on the script for waiting in the wings for their cue, vultures, and a persistent crocodile eager for a second chance. But then in the scene wildlife observers say is inexplicable, the hippopotamus remains to comfort the dying impala. An uncanny bond is formed between victim and saviour. The hippo takes the head of the impala in a delicate embrace. A scene never before filmed in the wild. It's an aversion though to the final scene. The not to be beaten predator appears for the final curtain, stealing the death scene after the hero's departure. Britain's bison.